Hi, I'm East Lansing Mayor Aaron Stevens. And I'm Michigan State University President Sam Stanley. Sometimes people say Grand River divides the city and the campus, but we don't see it like that. Even in these physically distanced times, we are united against a common enemy, COVID-19. As an infectious disease doctor, I understand all too well how disease can spread. And as a parent, I take seriously the commitment to put students' safety and the safety of our entire community first. That's why we're telling undergraduates to study from home this semester, and we're opening residence halls only to a limited number of students in special situations. For everyone's safety, we're urging students who don't need to be in East Lansing not to gather here this fall. At the same time, we realize many MSU students call East Lansing home. So we're working with our partners to keep our community as safe as possible. If you live in East Lansing, you need to know that a new Ingham County Health Department order restricts outdoor social gatherings to 25 people or less in parts of East Lansing, and indoor gatherings are restricted to 10 people or less throughout the city. The city also has a mask order that requires wearing a face covering at all times, indoors and out, in public spaces in the downtown area. The zones where social gatherings and mask orders apply can be seen here. Masks are also required on the MSU campus, indoors and out. They are an essential tool in limiting transmission of this virus, but they aren't sufficient by themselves. It's also really important to maintain physical distance from others. Both the City of East Lansing and MSU have developed ambassador programs to encourage wearing masks and provide education about policies and regulations. The health and safety of our community depends on each of us doing our part. We've already seen incidents where just a few people can infect many others. So please, wear a face covering, keep six feet between yourself and others, and avoid large social gatherings where it's difficult to keep a physical distance. These simple things will help to protect not only yourself, but those around you. And as partners, please know that the City of East Lansing will be notifying MSU about off-campus behaviors and violations that pose a threat to public health and safety. We take health and safety seriously. While education is our first line of defense, and we know most Spartans will do the right thing, individuals associated with MSU who repeatedly or severely violate the university's community compact may be subject to disciplinary action in alignment with university policies. It'll take all of us, student residents, year-round residents, and visitors to be mindful of the regulations and safety precautions we've put in place to help promote safety and stop the spread of this virus. We need to look out for each other by wearing a face covering, plus keeping physically distanced, washing hands frequently, monitoring yourself for symptoms, and staying home if you are sick. You can be a part of a proactive health and safety plan. These are important things for every Spartan to do, no matter where you live. Thank you for doing your part. We can do this. Let's all stay safe, help our businesses stay open, and take care of each other. Together, Together we, we will. will.